Hello, my beautiful people. Welcome back to my channel. It's us again. The hey. Grave Sisters, your fave sisters. That I'm gonna say that every time mm -hmm. now. Today we're gonna be playing Truth or Drink. Um, this video was inspired by Jesse B and Melanie Murphy's video. Um, we used some of the same questions, but some of them we found on the internet. So we're just saying it's inspired by that video. I will link it in the description if you want to go watch that. They're also my fave sisters, other than us too, obviously. <laughs> obviously, obviously. <laughs> okay, so how this works is we are going to say a question or a statement, and if we don't want to answer it, we drink. And we might need to refill these. Possibly. It's possible. It is so. possible. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. So I guess we'll just jump in with the first one. Okay, you can go. Okay. When, if and when, <laughs> you're trying to impress somebody, what personality trait do you try to hide? I don't really hide things from people. Like I'm kind of just like, well, th this is me. When I first meet someone, when I was younger, I used to f try to like think I needed to filter my personality. But now I'm like, you need to just like accept me, yeah. or it's not gonna work. Exactly. This is like just me. We don't really we don't filter really. ourselves. We don't. <laughs> We're kind of just like, well, if you don't well, like me, here it is. Bye. Yeah, that's okay. our style. Okay. Next. What is the longest you've gone to the shower? <laughs> I don't want my viewers to think bad about me, they, so I'm just not gonna. We don't need to talk about we that. Don't. <laughs> you just liked any of your sisters, girlfriends slash boyfriends. I know. Have you disliked any of your sisters? I know she probably has. For me. Oh, you're not gonna tell me? <laughs> At least I want to know if you're gonna dislike one of my. I, I dated some like I went through an emo phase in high school. <laughs> this is probably who she's referring to. Well, not just him. <laughs> no, you'll, you'll never know. No. Oh my god. But you never disliked any of my boyfriends, girlfriends. No. Like, I had like one. And and a half. Half. <laughs> like you know, like one and two halves. Yeah. Kind of one and a half. I don't know. Two halves. I mean, but no, I didn't just like the one and two halves. Okay. Cool. Yeah. Who is the moodier teenager? Me. Yeah. <laughs> I know. I was trying to hide. Well, I was trying to hide this. Well, she was like an angel child, like going to church all the time. <laughs> I'm still and a like, teenager. Oh my god. Yeah. You're still 18. I'm still a like, teenager. You're forgetting that you're like a teenager. But like, yeah, I was moodier. But by the time I was 18, like your age, I wasn't that moody. It was like, no. I think 14, 15. That's understandable because I was a little moody too. Like, I would be really. I would say some questionable things to mom. So yeah. Mom. I'm sorry, I love you, mom. I was a little I rebellious mean. for those yeah. like few years. <laughs> and we're like, it's okay, they're off band t shirts to make happy. High school. <laughs> Metallica. Metallica. It like, was so Edgy cool. teens. Hardcore. <laughs> Nobody believed it. Sorry. Not hardcore. I don't know why I did that. Oh, I'm curious as to who this was. Okay. Who was your first crush? Ah, oh, I don't really want to say that on public. Oh, public, like, it was like at first not reciprocated, and then once it was reciprocated, I stopped liking them. Oh, I'm it's just gonna drink. drink this sometimes. Okay. <laughs> um, mine, I'm pretty sure. The first crush that I can remember it was in kindergarten, and his really? name was Mike Miniaco. Mm -hmm. And so, Mike Miniaco, if you're watching this video right now, hey, Mike, you were my first crush. Oh, you know, that's my cute. Aww. Aww. Who was your first love? Okay, that's the, I can answer that. Um, my first boyfriend, Daniel. Aww. Hey that's Daniel, it. if you're watching this. Hey Daniel. <laughs> that was a very cute relationship. Yeah, it was yeah. really like sweet and like rest in peace, Kier Annual. <laughs> that's the worst shit ever, <laughs> Kier Annual. No wonder it didn't work out. Like that's just not okay. That was like some sort of an ailment. That does Kier Annual. <laughs> my Kier Annual tag. <laughs> Um, 
Whose name was Alex. She called me right after your first kiss and told me on the phone. So, um, we were walking down a neighborhood street and we were under, like it was cold out and like we were all bundled up and then it was under like a big like lamp post and he like whipped my jacket around, like he aggressively like grabbed my jacket, probably because he was nervous, like he didn't really know how to like do it, like how do I kiss a female human? Um, he like whipped me around and then kissed me, but he, he, um, he, he missed my mouth. Uh, it was dark out, it would be fair. To be fair, that was also his first kiss, so he, we both didn't know what we were doing, but he uh, missed my mouth. That's like... <laughs> mine is... Uh, mine was like a scarring memory from grade school. Like, oh, I know. This, this haunted me for years. The thing that happens in grade school, I told my best friend at the time, mm -hmm. who my crush was, and of course, she like told her friend, of course, course, another friend, and it eventually got back to my crush and his mm -hmm. group of friends. Mm -hmm. So our two groups of friends teamed up together to get me and him, like me and my crush, cornered in a corner <laughs> in a part of the playground. And then they planned, they plotted this out. It was a big conspiracy. <laughs> like, I don't trust anybody anymore. <laughs> and then I didn't want to kiss him. Because yeah, it was awkward, awkward and embarrassing. embarrassing. But all like my entire grade stood there and was like, kiss him, kiss him, kiss him. <laughs> and then he just like went in for it. Ooh. And um, then how was it? It was. Uh, it was like it was a. It was great, Matt. <laughs> <laughs> no, Wait, it was Matt. No, it was a different Matt. Oh, okay. I don't know if I should feel guilty for not liking my first kiss. No, it was weird it's and awkward. Fine. I, it's not. You're not. It's not really supposed to be like this amazing romantic thing that everyone thinks it's gonna be, you know what I mean? Like it yeah. never really lives up to that standard. Maybe yours has, I don't know, but mine definitely does. It was like it had the potential of being really cute, but then, yeah. Are there any parts of your sister's body that you wish you had? Yes. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Okay. Let's Are you going to say it? it? You say it. 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 I wish I had my sister's eyeballs. My eyeballs? Yeah. <gasps> I want her eyeballs. No. Oh. They're really big and beautiful and like they're just like bam. Like they're bigger than mine and yeah. Aww, yeah. And you. also your teeth. <laughs> My teeth? Yeah. You have great teeth. And eyeballs. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> I mean, you have to look at my face first. And like, <laughs> Come on. I want that. <laughs> your eyebrows. Really? And you between your eyebrows and your smile. Your smile is like so cute. She always Stop. had this really cute, like, just like sweetheart smile. And like sometimes when I smile, it's like, <laughs> shut <laughs> up! I like my smile. Perfect but I really like her smile. And her eye your eyebrows have like been perfect since you were like, Stop. she came out of the. She was like a baby with like good eyebrows, mm -hmm. and I didn't have any. You almost made me tear up. <laughs> like I don't know if you guys could see that, but my eyes were like. <laughs> what is the one thing you've never told me? <laughs> That's a whole nother video. That's another video. That is another. Yeah. Oh, what's one thing your parents don't know about you? Shit. Yeah. <laughs> It's all gonna be short things. things. No, it's not just, it's one, not just thing. one thing. It's like so many things yeah. that we share, we decide to share with each other and we don't share with our parents. Because the, our parents just don't need to know. They probably don't want to know. They, they probably, probably they probably don't, don't want to know. know. They'd yeah. be like, la 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 It's uncomfortable. When did you tell mom and dad you started drinking? We all had wine. Yeah, like mom and dad always offered us wine at dinner like when we were younger, so. I never felt like I needed to go out and drink and party because it's always like been around the house. So I'd say that I started drinking with my parents. <laughs> I mean, I got caught once when I was going to a New Year's Eve party in high school and I took a bottle of wine from the garage. I heard and about then, that. And I, oh my God, you'd think, anyway, I committed like a felony. Anyway, we had so much fun at home. I was like, they're not gonna miss one bottle of wine. I remember hearing about that and everyone was like shit talking to you and I was like, what? Oh my god. <laughs> she, she's an alcoholic. <laughs> like, she jumped out the window with a bottle of wine. I did not jump out the window. I thought that's what happened. Why would, no, mom said she went to my friend's house. 
Someone told me that Alexa jumped out the window with a bottle of wine. Like a bandit. <laughs> That's what I'm picturing with like a black mask on, like the black hood. <laughs> Alexa <laughs> is the black hood. This is my rebellious teenage years Riverdale reference. Oh, yeah, the, the black hood. Have you ever taken something of your sister's without asking her first? Yes. Yeah. yeah. I just used, like, for example, I just used your trash shampoo. I used to take my sister's candy necklaces from her. Oh my god. Uh, I used to eat all of her candy necklaces. This drove me nuts. <laughs> like, but I was young, like, I was a baby. Yeah, I was a child. Like, they were, like, in my jewelry box. So she would just, like, go in there as, like, a little kid and just start, like, and then she would put them back. Ew. Partially. Oh, yeah, you put it back. Like licked and partially nibbled on. So there'd be pieces <laughs> missing from my candy necklace. I'd be like, Kira, did you go in my room and eat my candy necklace? What would I say? And be like, no. <laughs> no. What a liar. <laughs> like, and they were like a trend for whatever. So they, they were. were a trend, in the early 2000s, you know if you if you lived if, in the early if 2000s. If you're in your mid 20s. Yeah. Or in your late teens. You yeah. Will, you will know. Yeah. They were a thing. We didn't drink as much as I thought we were going to drink. We didn't. No. I was. I feel like we're pretty straight up, like we're straight up people. We are. We don't really like hide much like... from each other. Um, there are a lot of embarrassing things that you know about me that no one else knows about me though. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> and I'm not ready to share that on YouTube, so. <laughs> Sorry. If you have any suggestions for questions, mm -hmm. that you if you want us to, to do a part two, if you want us to do more sister videos, just let me know, folks. Just let me know in the comments. Bye! 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 Bye. 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 Bye.